new podcast is up, and this time it's debate night. Aaron and I debate such topics as iPhone versus Android, what is the best rom-com, and hot dog, sandwich or no. A hot dog is not a sandwich because it's uglier than a sandwich <laughs> usually is. <laughs> All right, I'll take the point. Uh, thank you. <laughs> we also give you your horoscopes in the worst way possible. Click the links below. It's free. Listen today. Leave your answers in the comments below. Beep, beep. Yesterday, I asked you if you had Jeff Bezos' billions and billions of dollars, what would you do? Here are your answers that I'm seeing for the first time. Pay off student loans for one student. Two if you stretch it. This one's funny because student loan debt is crippling. Buy a lot of Among Us BTS chicken nuggets. Oh, it's from the BTS meal. Sorry, the BTS threw me off for a sec. That's it? 100K? That's what we call a Jeffrey Bezos steal. Pay workers to flip Australia right side up. Get it? Because they're topsy-turvy, honey. Why does your hair look so fluffy? It does look fluffy. Well, enjoy it while I have it, right? <laughs> Why do I enjoy it? Oh, the hair. I get it. There you go. She got it. Ladies and gentlemen, she got it. This joke's funny because um, Australia is just wrong. Like, it's tomorrow always there for some reason. Their toilets go this way instead of that way. Whenever they film something, they have to hold the camera upside down. Start a currency called Bezos Pesos. I'll be rivaling Zuckerbucks. One Bezos Peso is worth three pesos. More currencies should rhyme. You know, like Hamilton Slamiltons, or like a, a Lincoln Lincoln. A Lincoln Lincoln. It's hard. <laughs> that's on you, dum dum. Build a rocket that's not shaped like a dick, but why? That's like the coolest statement. No, come back. She's literally tiptoeing out. She's doing, she's doing this. But we heard her. Everyone heard her. Everyone heard her. You ain't slick. Oh, here she comes again. <laughs> I just needed my phone. Oh my god. As I was saying, all rockets should be dick shaped. Launch Bezos into space again, but this time with the intention of not letting him return. Only enough fuel for a one-way trip. The change.org petition must be on. There's a petition now for this? Yikes. I want to see that petition. Is it one of those petitions where like if enough people sign it, the White House legally has to look at it? Is that how petitions work? This one seems a little cruel. But then again, if enough people sign it. Go to the dollar store and finally be able to afford the things more than a dollar. No, how about you shut down that dollar store for false advertising? Call it Bezos Pesos, <laughs> where everything costs 10 Bezos Pesos. She loved that one. Cast him in the new Fantastic Four movie with the Space Buddies, and then you photoshopped exactly that. I don't know why though. I don't know what inspired you to do this. I do like his very long arm though. That's actually quite good. Okay, now I see why you did it. For that joke alone, you get three Bezos Pesos, which is equal to one Yai token. Yeah, have fun with that, figure that out. Can you fund a Fantastic Four movie that's somehow worse than the last one? Like make it even darker and boringer and then do like a really cringy crossover? Like have Deadpool show up and be like, holy chimichangas, it's the Fantastic Four. There you go, whatever it takes to get that Rotten Tomatoes score below zero. I'd buy a bunch of AC units to eradicate global warming. The solution was so simple, it was right in front of us the whole time. That's a good yai question. How would you fix global warming? But then every answer would be, just blast my AC. <laughs> but seriously, Bezos, do the right thing. Spend your Bezos pesos on billions of AC units so we can blast the sun away. I think that's how that works. Put the money on a fishing pole and watch him try to get it back. <laughs> Mr. Beast, we just made your next video. <laughs> Write a check out for just an insane amount of money. Something disgusting. Put it at the end of a fishing line, dangle it into a crowded area, and hit record. <laughs> uh, uh, oh, oh, I almost got, oh. You will get far more dislikes than likes, but think of the views. I'd pay off my student loans, then have enough to cover my rent for like six months. Get it? This one's funny because student loan debt be crippling. Why is this video like just the hot spot for student loan debt jokes? On the tier of comedy, that's like C or D. I'd put this slightly below toilet humor. Oh my god. So Chipwitch just peed on a carpet minutes after I watched her pee on the grass outside. If I had all of Bezos pesos, I would surgically remove Chip's bladder. 
and also her butthole. I would scientifically engineer the perfect dog. I'd figure it out. Hide it from Jeff Bezos. He probably wants it back. He's not getting it back. So now we're into the dad joke portion of the video. I'm so sorry. For wasting my time and all of our time, I am subtracting uh, three eye tokens from your score. You're gonna have to work extra hard to get out of that debt. This is a debt worse than student loan debt and far funnier. I will use them for charity and help the one in need. And I'll buy DreamWorks and make another 30 Shrek movies. Hey, give this person the billions. I want annual Shrek releases like Saw. Just spit them out. Make it the new Fast and Furious. Shrek goes into space. Shrek finds a time machine. Oh, he, there was a time travel. <laughs> Fuck it, give it to him again. I want so many Shrek movies, I'm sick of him. Make Nevada bigger? Why? What a waste. Why would you expand an already pretty large state? What is your reasoning? This answer makes as much sense as your username, Princess Quantum. Quantum, take back, Never mind. I got nothing. I'm just confused and angry and confused. Buy every NFL team, then permanently end football. If someone opens another league, buy it out. A lot of people want you to end football. <laughs> I'm not against it at all. I'm, I'm entirely neutral on the subject. I watch one game a year and I, you know, it's, it's for the commercials. I like that. I really like how you phrase that. Permanently end football. Bezos could, he literally could. He could end any sport he wants to. This is funny and fresh. Samuel, for thinking outside the box, you get 207 Yai tokens, one for every billions that Jeff has. On a serious note, I'd pay my taxes, let my employees get bathroom breaks, and pay them better. JK, I'd burn it lull. No, you wouldn't. Don't lie to me on my show. God, what a Gemini thing to say. I think, I don't, I, I would rightfully return his money because I'm not a criminal. Um, hero alert, Big Balls James over here. I'm sure he would thank you and then give you a handsome reward of three Bezos pesos. And then he'd tax you on the pesos. And then he'd say, get back to work. Buy paper towels and soak up the Pacific Ocean. <laughs> Some of these ideas just sound like Mr. Beast videos. <laughs> I soaked up the Pacific Ocean with paper towels? It just shows him like, whole, mm, mm. behind him, the, the, the ocean just being soaked up, the trillions of gallons. And maybe, maybe he's shrugging a little bit. He's like, I don't know. I ended the ocean. <laughs> 58 million views its first week. And the top comment has a thousand likes and the comment reads, great video, please support my small growing channel. And the account name is uh, Family Guy Quagmire Compilations. I'm gonna be here a while. I haven't seen one of these in years. Turn your own penny into a souvenir. Honey, do you ever, do you ever do that? Do you ever uh, crank a penny into a different um, elongated unusable penny? They make you pay 50 cents to do it too. No. They make you pay 51 cents. I'm looking at it right now. Do they actually like mold your penny or do they just have like something pre-made? You've never done it? I have, I just don't believe it. <laughs> it's real, Jack. It's science. This is a funny idea though. Let's do the math. How many pennies are in 200 billion dollars? Uh, 100. Yeah, 20 trillion pennies. 20 trillion pennies times, let's take 30 seconds. It's a lot of seconds, hold on. I can figure that out. It's 600 trillion seconds. Uh, 6.9 <laughs> billion days. We did the math, Reddit. The answer to the question you didn't ask is you will be there for 19 million years. Epic. Isn't Yai fun? You learn here. Hope you charged your Nintendo Switch. You're gonna be here for a while. Buy every single PS5 on eBay and Facebook, then sell them all back to people who want them at the original retail price. That's super nice of you, because you know the ones on eBay are like, what, $3,000? Something obscene? It's probably not even real. It's probably just like a picture of a PS5. If I had $200 billion, um, I'd make a PS5 run Mario. I'd get it all in quarters and glue them together to make a ladder to the moon. It's the environmentally friendly way to get to space. Can't you just build the ladder? Or at least a space elevator? Isn't that a thing? Google image search space elevator. Don't glue your quarters together. What a waste of currency and glue, idiot. All right, let's do the math and figure out how tall this pile of quarters would be. Just kidding. All right, take the thickness of a quarter, fraction of an inch, right? Multiply it by 200 billion t times four, it comes to 800 billion quarters, 800 billion times the thickness of a quarter, there's the length of your ladder. I'd use all my wealth and power to make it so the employees at Amazon can have at least a five minute bathroom break. Not me, I would just give them more, um, more water bottles to pee in. Joe, you know what? You've worked super hard this week. Have another pee bottle. <laughs> You've earned it. Chip witch! 
just had a fun accident. Chip was startled by um, one of the dogs and somehow spilled a cup of coffee all over our wall. If I had $200 billion, I would surgically remove, along with her bladder and butthole, all her paws and legs and arms. Hard to jump around and get startled if you don't have those. I would, I would do, do it humanely. Humane. I don't know how, but I'd figure out a way. I would make Cruella too. <laughs> Tuella, <laughs> and still, <laughs> and still have almost four billion dollars left. Yeah. Congratulations, you are the only good answer today. A fifty million Yai tokens and exclusive VIP tickets to see Cruella to Tuella. <laughs> Great movie. I think. I don't know. I don't remember. I would sit on the money like a dragon. What's up with dragons always be sitting on money and they can't even, they don't even spend it. You know what I'm saying? Dragons be hoarding. <laughs> Save for retirement. Taste test expensive wine. Rent an expensive condo. Invest in crypto. Pay off my debts. Private island. End world hunger. Reimburse those I owe. Set up eco-safe means of energy around the world. Nice. These are really noble things. And it's a good thing I can't spell, otherwise I'd be able to read what this says. The obvious question, and I think you mean answer, is finally pay off my student loans. The bigger question is, what do I do afterwards with the remaining 83? Do you guys notice? It's funny because student loans cost a lot. The joke is, Titanius here is exaggerating um, the actual cost of student loans. It was funny the first two times, but a third time it's even funnier. I'd actually fix major problems like climate change and the housing crisis. Then I'd probably get a really good sandwich. I think you deserve to treat yourself after fixing those two problems. What would a really expensive sandwich look like that only billionaires can get? It has avocado, it has maple syrup, it has caviar, um, it has a little sandwich in it, maybe a pizza in it. The bread is pancakes. What was that McDonald's breakfast item? Wasn't there a McDonald's breakfast item where the um, it was a sandwich but the buns were little pancakes? Does anyone know what I'm talking about? Uh-oh, they're about to bomb me. I create an armada of yachts to destroy his measly two yachts. Serious! He only has two yachts? Shouldn't a billionaire have an armada like you say? Why are you so stingy with the yachts, Bezos? You're kind of a cheap billionaire, dude. Two yachts, shit. I put a yacht on my yacht. I would buy Jeff Bezos and then wear his skin, cool. Hey man, with 200 billion, you could do whatever you wanted. I got my eye on you, Lewis Liam 09. That'd be cool if you like started parading around town wearing his skin, going, look at me, I'm Jeff Bezos. And everyone would clap and laugh. Oh. I have a question for you. Some people are comparing this still of me to the soy jack meme and I fail to see the resemblance. So please don't Photoshop this picture of me. Thank you. Leave your answers in the comments below. I'll pick my favorites in the next episode of Yai. Please subscribe for more Bezos Pesos. Also click right here to see the previous Yai episode. Uh, here's a clip. What are some red flags you might find in someone's Tinder bio? If you can't handle me at my work, you ain't know me again. This is code for someone who is always at their worst. Only God can judge me. Run, get out of there quick.